Hello everyone, Assalamu alaikum. Here we'll take a look how to return a document ID after creating the document. So let's go ahead and do that. So first we'll go ahead and do await and then we'll get Firebase Firestore inst instance, Firebase Firestore dot instance. And after that actually we wanna do a collection. Now here we'll create a collection named chat. It doesn't exist yet. And after that here we're gonna add data. Now in general, when you add data to Firebase, that would be a JSON data. So here I'll create two fields. I would say field one, and then I would say here, this is a text, all right. And then I'll create another field, and I'll call it field two. Instead of this, I'll just say 10. Now with this, actually, it would be able to create, if we go ahead and run, it would be, go, it would be able to create a document but uh, we want to get the document ID as well. Now how to do that? So after once it creates, we want it to return. Now there is a function which is called then, we can go ahead and call that one. And inside this, we can use reference, document reference, document reference, and we'll call it doc. And inside this, actually we can just do a print and we'll see that we can access the document ID. So simply here we'll say print my document ID is and inside this we do doc and ID because doc will have ID object so we can go ahead and get that. All right, so what's gonna happen once I go ahead and run the code, it'll check if there is a collection chat or not. If there is not, it'll create one and after that it'll add this data and data will have two fields. And after adding, because we are here using then function, instead then it takes document reference and for that reference actually, which means the newly created document, which is this one, for that one actually we'll get the document ID. So let's go ahead and test it. So now here I'm going to restart, I did. Now this is my simulator and I'm gonna randomly write here anything, random text and I'm gonna hit the send button. So once I hit the send button, this will get executed. Now it's doing, now here you see that it says my document ID is this. Now we can go ahead and check in our Firebase console and verify that. So there is a document ID, 2YGR, and then the collection should be checked. And here we do see that we have a collection named chat and the document ID is 2Y and ends with GR and we have this two field, right? Now, one more time, we can go ahead and check it. Now I'm going to do a new one over here, a new test, just write randomly anything, it doesn't matter. Okay, now it created a new document ID, right? So let's go ahead and check that. Now here we see the document ID. So just to return it, simply do, after adding your data, just simply call then, and inside this, just call this anonymous function with this uh, document reference object, and you're good to go.